In this clip, I'm going to show you how to measure and cut your batting. This is extra loft batting, and I've layered it into four layers for thickness, otherwise it would be really thin. When you're cutting your batting, you want to make sure that you cut it within two inches shorter than what your material was. Because when you sew it, you're going to sew about a one inch seam on each side, so this is going to have to be smaller to be able to fit in. So I've, met, I've folded it four times, and I'm going to measure it. So my dog bed was 42 inches long, and I'm going to cut and mark this at 40 inches so that I have one inch give on each side, because when you sew it together, you're going to have a one inch seam. You don't want to have it ruffled up at the edges. So we're marking it at 40 inches all the way across. And if you get ink all over the place on this, it don't matter because it's going to be hidden on the inside. Now on this side, the dog bed was 32 inches wide, or 36 inches wide, and then so I'm going to cut it at 40, 34, so it'll fit. So I'll mark it all the way down again. This will even up the edges for stuffing. Again, it doesn't have to be exact because you're going to stuff it on the inside. Just want to make sure when you're cutting it that you lift it up so that you're not cutting the material that you have underneath it and you don't have anything underneath it that you could accidentally cut. Now we have our batting for the inside of the dog bed.